So, girls, how do I look? You look beautiful. Oh, thank you, Karen. Do I look beautiful? You look OK. You look gorgeous, Mary. Why are wedding dresses white? Because Mummy says it's bad colour because it shows the dirt. That's true. I mean, it's not so very practical, is it? And also, why are your wedding dresses funny? Funny? Yes, because when I ask my mummy and daddy in the car, would the bride be wearing white, they said yes and started giggling. Did they? And they tried to hide it, but I could see mummy's shoulders moving up and down like this. Right. Great. Right, Ben, little reminder. Gravel, confetti. And you seem to get the two a bit confused at your Auntie Sandra's wedding, didn't you? And when the priest says, does anyone know any reason why these people can't get married? No shouting out funny answers, all right? You mean like she's a man? Yes. Exactly like that. You're very lucky your Auntie Sandra's got such a good sense of humour. Who's that? That's Sam. We used to go out together. How many of your boyfriends are here? Not many. A few. A few. What about... what about the bald one? Oh, Colin. My mum liked him. Did she? No, Colin. Colin's not here. What about that one that was friends with the Queen? Sorry? Friends with the Queen. He is friends with the, with the Queen, you know. Um... He's friends with the Queen. He's the guest of Her Majesty. Right. Right, no, no, he's, he's not here. Is he at Buckingham Palace? No, he's not at Buckingham Palace. My mummy didn't like him. So, so your mummy and daddy were discussing my taste in boyfriends, were they? Yes. Right. Who's Aurica? I don't know what I would do if I was attacked by a polar bear, Ben. Bleed to death, probably. Now, come on, sit there. Space by your mother. No, there isn't. Yes, there is. No, there isn't, look. There's a space. Yeah, there's there's quite there. obviously a space next to you. Why come next on, Ben. To me? Why room. next to me? Hey, budge up. Come on. Yeah, come up here and you can sit. Ow, oh, oh. idiot. Shh. This, this brings back so many memories of my wedding day. Crowded church, everyone in their finery. And Jane, oh, Jane, so beautiful. Breathtaking she was. Dad, Mum's name is Joan. I know. She had this gorgeous friend called Jane. Real stunner. <laughs> I, I can't believe that you that you just just because you're getting married doesn't mean you've got to stop admiring but beautiful that's women. Just at the altar. Oh you, come on! It's just, just what men are like. Weird. So you promised to love him forever and ever, but how do you know that's true? I just know. I love Derek. That's all there is. But so you didn't love any of those other boyfriends, like the bald one and the one that was friends with the Queen? Well, I suppose at the time, you, you think you loved them, but... Then it turns out that you were wrong all those times. Yes. But you're right this time. Yes. And that's happy and good. That is happy and good. Why has Jesus got that sad expression on his face? Well, he's being crucified and it's making him feel sad. He's got nails in his hand. He should be going, ah, shush. We should. Shoppy old Jesus. Ben, please. It's not realistic. <gasps> Could you just... Hey, look, it's Angela. She's made it. Isn't that brilliant? Oh, yeah, that's... that. That's brilliant. Hi. Hi, Pete. Hi, Dad. Hi. Mm. Sue. Hi, Jake. Hi. Hi, Ben. I'm so sad. Ben. Could you... He hasn't changed, I see. It's fantastic you could make it. It's just a whistle-stop tour, I'm afraid. My boss can't spare me for long. <laughs> of course not, no. Come here. How long have you known Derek? 
Ten months? That's not a very long time. Oh, look, what a lovely staircase. My mummy and daddy don't live together anymore. Mummy said that on their wedding day, she thought he was the most wonderful man on the planet. Now, she just cries all the time. Here we go, sweetheart. All set? Julie's got tears in her eyes. Wow, it's an emotional day.